Okay, so this is going to be a really short video probably, but when we have a function, um, say you have f of x, some function, and um, it has a domain, right? We've talked about that. We can write that as the domain with a subscript f, okay? And then it also has a range. And we've talked about domain and range before. So you can write r and then uh, subscript f. So we're talking about the domain of f and the range of f. So then if we have an inverse function, um, you know, I don't, I don't like the x there. I mean, sometimes they just write them f and f inverse. They don't tell you, like, what variable it's going to be in terms of. But what happens when you go to the inverse is the domain of the original function is the range of the inverse. And the range of the original function is the domain of the inverse. They switch places. So it's like the range of the function, the original function, is the domain of the inverse, and the domain of the original function is the range of the inverse. Okay, so you can go back to our example that we had with the movies and the, um, the uh, Academy Awards, the number of Academy Awards. The domain was, for the movies, for the original function, you know, f, it was, what were those movies? Um, Ben-Hur, <laughs> The Titanic, uh, Lord of the Rings, and West Side Story, right? That was the domain. The range was 11 and 10, right? Three of the movies that each got 11 Academy Awards, and then West Side Story only got 10 Academy Awards. Okay, so that was the domain and the range. When we go to do the inverse, and this is not a function, so I have a little problem but with my example, but say it's the relation, the domain would be um, the 11 and 10, and then the range would be the movies, okay? So this turns out to not be a function, because you have the mapping 11 going three places, so this is not a function. But we'll talk about that issue in other videos when that happens, okay? But that's what happens with the domain and range. They switch places, okay? So the domain and range of the function become the range and the domain of the inverse, okay? They switch places. So much for my short video.